why don't we start with LeBron's extension and the 97 mil, two more years, what will he be 40 at that point? Or is this an extension on years he already has left? He's got one year left and it's a two year extension. Looks like it's a player option for 24, 25. Why is that significant folks? Bronny James comes into the league in 2024. So maybe LeBron opts out, but this is definitely the way this lines us up is this makes the Lakers have to make moves because he can get out of there in a year after the 23 season, uh, 23, 24 season. If things don't go well, he could be gone. Look for the Lakers now to start to push their chips to the middle of the table, whatever chips they got. I mean, those may be, you know, checker for chips that they're going to try to push to the middle of the table. Whatever chips they got, you better start pushing to the table. Otherwise, LeBron is gone after 23-24. He'll opt out. So I watched his kid play in Paris the other day. I don't know if you caught that game. Uh, it, there were times when he looked good throwing down dunks, and obviously that's what they run on you know, uh, television. Everybody on ESPN likes to show him dunking. But, you know, I saw him missing several drive layup kisses off the glass where he didn't even hit the rim. I saw him miss several threes, just flat out bricks. And then there was a report that he was going to go to Oregon, which his father refuted. If you could give me what you think of his game, I'd appreciate it. And uh, he's still got another year. Carver High and I think he should go play college ball at least one and done. And I said he should go to UCLA. I mean, if he's already an L.A. boy and they want you to play at Pauley Pavilion for Mick Cronin, don't you just go right through the door? I mean, playing right there will put him right next to his dad with his eyes on him all the time. Listen, you know, this is partially about NIL money. Listen, he's number 38 in the draft board, and I'm, I'm sorry, in the top, you know, 100 for ESPN class of 2023. We're not talking like DJ Wagner. Good. I mean, he's good. He's gotten better. But with all the pub and with LeBron talking on him, Pharrell, he's only moved up like four or five spots. He hasn't taken that quad- that huge leap into the top 20, top 25 players. But I will say this. If he's anywhere good this year, you know for damn sure he'll be in the McDonald's All-American game. He'll be in the Jordan Brand Classic. Because for that, for everybody – about Bronny, this is about what can he do with his legacy. Game wise, different for all. Only six three, one eighty. Doesn't have the height. The height is with the younger brother. I think he's about six five. So Bronny's still got a little ways to go. Look at him as more of a a combo, more of a point guard at the next level.